This is the holding slide. It's going to be up for 20 seconds. As soon as it changes, I will start speaking. Uh, and, yep, okay. As soon as that slide changes, I will start. You were all born geniuses. From the day you left your mother's womb, you were a genius. And I don't make this up. This is neuroscience. Neuroscience says that every child is born a genius, particularly a creative genius, with the capability to create new ideas and to discover new things. And as we go on, we end up going to school. And the purpose of education is to prepare children for a future, to fill their minds with knowledge, to get them ready to go out in the world and to make change. It's an institution we had for some 300, 400 years. But I would suggest to you something. I would suggest to you that this formula is broken. And it's probably always been broken. And I'm not just saying that bad teachers and bad schools produce bad uh, students. I'm saying the purpose of school is lost. What schools are supposed to do is not what they're really doing. Because they're not preparing kids for the future that's coming tomorrow. And they're only focusing on one half of your brain. Schools focus on doing this for you. To make you analytical, to make you logical, to fill your brain with knowledge. What they lack is intuition, creativity, and imagination. That's taught right out of you as a kid. And it's taught out of you starting in first grade. How many of you remember your first grade teacher? Raise your hand. Do you have good memories of her? Yeah? She damaged you, right? <laughs> she started you on this road where you have to do, you have to give the A to B in everything. There was one right answer. There was only one way to do it. You needed to sit down, shut up, raise your hand, give me the answer, and I will tell you how things are. And that's what we end up with. We end up with kids who have this one right answer. The answer they can get to the quickest. One plus one is two. There's no chance of discovering another possibility. Because one and one is also 11. It's also a plus sign. It's also a T. But we lose that sense of discovery. We lose the creative ability. We're told how to think. And we're told how to think because we're forced to think that knowledge is the only basis by which we make decisions. We only believe in what we can prove using what we know today. It eliminates our intuition and our ability to think beyond the limitations of today. Knowledge is paramount in education. These are institutions of knowledge, and they're driven by law.